Are you thinking of buying in a new condo building in this buyer-centric market? Here are essential questions you need to ask to minimize your risk. One, what's the exact plan for the building? To find out, have your attorney carefully review the offering plan. Two, what's the outside date? If the building isn't completed by the scheduled date, then you can usually get your down payment back. Three, what's the developer's track record? Google the sponsor as well as the development firm to see what other buildings they have completed and the level of buyer satisfaction. Four, any closing costs I should know about? Some developers pass on unexpected expenses to buyers. These are listed in the offering plan. Five, is the price negotiable? Sales in 2018 fell sharply on new development. Best way to negotiate is to educate yourself and use comps to support your price. Six, how about concessions? These don't affect price, but they can save you a lot of money. Examples are closing costs, transfer taxes, mansion taxes, or free storage. Seven, what building extras am I willing to pay for? Some new buildings offer over-the-top amenities to attract buyers. Make sure these amenities are important to you because you will be paying for them in your monthly charges. Eight, if the building comes with a tax abatement, when does it expire? Usually they last for 10 years. Find out how much taxes you will be paying when the tax break ends. Nine, what does the model look like? You will be able to see the quality of the finishes. Ten. Does the design fit my lifestyle? If you rarely cook, then a sleek, small galley kitchen is fine. Not so if you have a family. Look at the layout and lighting also. 11, can I get a mortgage? It is possible, however, banks typically don't issue loans until 51% of the units are sold. 12, when can I move in? Usually 12 to 18 months, but there could be unexpected delays. 13, what kind of retail will the building have? Important to know so you don't get stuck with noise or an unpleasant surprise. 14. Who are the neighbors? Empty lots? Better find out because this will affect the quality of your life. 15. What are the heating and cooling systems? HVAC units stick out in the room. They can be quite inefficient or noisy. Some super luxury condos have systems that are truly central. 16. What about the soundproofing between apartments? Additional layers of sheetrock take care of this. 17. What's the experience of the residents so far? Try to visit the building in the evening and meet people in the amenity spaces if you can. 18. Can I rent out my condo? Some developers prohibit renting out an apartment until a year after closing. 19. Are there any special restrictions? Some buildings make you own for a certain amount of time in order to discourage flippers who would be competing with a sponsor. 20. What's the best way to conduct my walkthrough? Hire an inspector who will walk through with a punch list to check off what is missing or needs repaired.